yesterday afternoon before I left the SESI, um, I had arranged, or you know, Henry had arranged for me to come out to the um, out to the centre, you know, the um, Future Star Centre, which is one of the key projects that we work with. And unbeknownst to me, the young people there um, had organised a bit of a um, I guess a demonstration of some of the things that they've been doing and music and things like that, which was really cool. I always feel slightly awkward, but you know there was a um, you know with big I don't know formal events, but but yeah, it was kind of done in my honour, which was lovely. And so I turned up um, through the gate, and they were all standing there and kind of clapping, and I'm like, oh, when will this be over? But we sat down and we and we listened to um, you know some of them sing and some of them talk. And then we just had this lovely time of having conversations afterwards. And you would never know the struggle that these kids have gone through. You know, these are kids who have lost their parents, who have absolutely nothing. And yet I am someone, or Future Stars, the local organisation, with the support of I am someone, has actually managed to mentor them through to the point that um, they're, they're ready to kind of engage with the world. And a number of them talked about the different professions that they're wanting to go on to and the schooling, and they're in the upper kind of years of just about finished their school or in, um, in kind of further training right now. And, and realising that this kind of work, when you support kids all the way through from that abject poly all the way through to getting them through education, will change the world. Um, and that for me is really inspiring. These young people have been through hell and yet they still have this incredible hope for the future because of the support that this organisation has done. So um, I've given you snippets of this, I have asked them permission whether I can share this, um, but, uh, but yeah, so enjoy. These are really inspiring young people. Try to remember the situation I was in before I came here. Brothers and sisters, I greet you all. I am also one one of the people who have achieved in this organization. You know, when I came here, I was just a young girl. Okay. It has been long. You know, when you keep and remember where they got you from, and you see where you are right now, Things are totally different. And as I am standing here, I couldn't believe that I would be in front of people talking. But because of the support of Steve and Brad, plus the rest, that's why you can see me shining. Okay, I appreciate you. You know, when I heard of that, is coming to Uganda riding a bike. <laughs> I was really surprised. Brad, thanks for your love. Moses, I am someone of our future staff foundation. Jude, Australian, Steve, and Mark. Well done. I am someone who will never stop, slow, and sure to reach my station. I'm a man now, but I'm not talking. Disability is not inability. I am someone who will never stop, slow, and sure to reach my station. I'm a man now, but I'm not talking. Disability is not inability. And if I walk in on my future days, you will still be my nigga man. And if I walk in on my future days, you will still be my nigga man. And if I walk in on my future days, you will still be my nigga man.